Crash trying to go for a pincer maneuver here, but Starsight intercepts. Vic is kind of teleporting yeah. for me. Unfortunately, OBS had the innermost position, so no one was really able to pinch in that spot just because of how far away Crash was. That being said, Booyah Bomb catches three, and now it's catches. Shy alone versus the world. First push goes to Soul, and uh, it's a big oops. one. First big misstep, it looks like, from one brain cell shared. Uh, they went a little too aggressive. A little too aggressive, Bunched but it looks up. like they're going to try and stall this push out at 30. Two go down from either side. Crash onto the far left. Doesn't have any clams to keep this open at the moment. Nope. And it is going to close. It is going to close. Vic and uh, Crash. Starsight does go down to Vic. Does Radon go down to Vic. Radon's the only one alive, but he gets a triple! Yep. But Crash and he's clipping it! Too. And he's clipping it! Another push, gonna get it in the bottom side, but it's going to be a little difficult to follow up. There is a jump coming in, but it's a little far away from the base. Vic's gonna get the opening. Booyah Bomb secures it, and they're going to be able to kill Oh, it's just a little whiff, short! The whiff, the whiff, and they're white. He'd have to, but he did. That being said, Radon takes down Icy, obviously the one they want to be picking the Rainmaker up. Takes down Vic, but not before a push to nine, and the curling bomb gets outlaw. A quad right. from the Clash Blaster. Thank you, Autocam, for picking the one for this one person. Because if I didn't see half that quad, I would have been very upset. This is going to be the change of the lead, but they're in a setup to win the game. Uh oh. They just need to get go. two more picks. Here comes the lockout phase. Here comes the lockout. They just need Star to get two more picks. Star knows they're going to come on the left side. Booyah Bomb comes uh -oh. out, just paint over it! Uh oh, Shy goes down. They just need to paint over it. They know two is left, now they need to back out. They can't, they can't KO off this. No, they can't. Oh, that's that Ray, that Ray's dead. That's gonna be game. This is gonna be oh, a 3 out of soul. Unfortunately, a little bit of indecision when they had the control. Not sure if they want to attack, attack the left side or let it come to them. That opening is just enough for soul to retake mid and a couple staggered kills means soul takes the sweep and score more but they still Flick. have the lead it's a wipe no. oh man that is a wipe and court ha and court has the football right now but court is going to interestingly squid jump in that was a very slow uh this choice there but it, other either way court does break the barrier and cool is in position to catch nine up. And now it goes down. So like, Cord should have just swam through. Don't root. jumping was actually slower. Yeah, I was a little surprised. I was a little surprised. Oh my god! Yeah, you're right. Flick just. They Flick. have three power clamps. That's thirty points. Oh if Jesus! They can you're connect. right. That's they, they, forty right now. They just they, one just fell short. One fell just fell short. I don't think I don't Otter think I realize needs... it. Uh, nope, Otter. But Otter's gonna get some extra clams though. Otter oh picks up the power clamp. They get it. It's twenty-one. Holy moly, I thought that I thought that power climb was about to disappear. Otter was able to save it in time. Flick, Flick is gonna keep it open here. Oh my god, Flick Flick actually does keep does keep it alive. Three more clamps in for the possible KO right now. Pasta is able to able to come back nicely after being able to can this finish this off here. Yep, that's it. Down it's an immediate wipe. It's a wipe here. Alright, they're gonna go through the block. Tolf is gonna come and try to pressure, try oh. to stall the Push. Only Plick is alive here. Plick is gonna go back. He's gonna go the other way. Everybody's rotated, but Tolf does pick off Plick. I oh, that's Tolf. a that's a delay wipe. Kenneth's going through block, but does barely gets on there, but dies on top. And that, Plick uh, is sharking here. Plick, Plick, Plick is absolutely sharking. Plick, Plick was able to find Cool Out. The splashdown not quite enough to take out Cord. But Cord's gonna actually use the blue bomb near the Rainmakers. I'm boo. I'm a little surprised by the Charger pack. You would think, you would think that they would try that they would try to go for a little bit more inking power on the zone, especially with but that, especially with the fact that you could, um it is flat flat zones right now. Ooh, actually, that's a fast wipe here. Toy <laughs> did work here. Penalty is gone for Splat. Yeah, Plick is gonna use bomber. She's gonna try to at least neutralize with bombers. But oh, cord! Cord just went down. Out a bit. Cord just went down, Plick but goes down. But Plick, yeah, Plick just went down. They got 15 points remaining. They got they they just gotta keep defending this zone right now. 
uh, does Pasta have enough have a push within them? No, they're just inking no, over that. That's game. And then they're going to the first checkpoint. Yep. Still, still, still very, still very early, early though. But um, they they just made it to checkpoint one. Tolf trying to trying to use that range of the seizure to pick off Kenda, and Tolf actually goes uh, up. That's a team wipe. That's a team wipe. I think Tolf shouldn't have dropped there. He should have probably just tried to charge up that stingray. Pasta's on the other side, but because checkpoint one, it, but because it's smallish map, Pasta's able to quickly make their way back. Kenda's gonna go down Ooh. to the Booyah Bomb, though. Just Plick alive right now. Kichi's coming in. Yeah, Kichi's now dropping in, so like, this can be a big push for Splat. Kichi's gonna try to move towards checkpoint two. Now, he's moving back. Kenda's Ken gonna pressure Al. Kenda's gonna try to try to find the spot on Al. Al just went down. Cord is right behind Kichi. Cord just took out Kichi for that matter. And the Booyah Bomb will take out Kenda. Plick is having to be uh -oh. forced out of there. And Plick goes Tolf. down again. Toll. All right. This is big here. It's just Kichi. They need to stall Kichi out here. They can take. They're gonna take lead here. They just they took the head lead. to the. Their cloud goes down. They don't make it to the final checkpoint. But now this game has turned around. Splat. Are kind of in a range disadvantage. It oh, goes down to that hammer yeet. The hammer yeet just just took out, what well, just took out airlock. Could they now try to push back in? And man, Splat just have has full control right out of the gate with the air, with the yeah, with the arrow spray. Quart is, yeah, Quart is trying to escape. Oh, they oh. just to expect here so far. Yeah, they're just gonna. Tol's gonna just charge right into that zone, and Ooh. Kichi just went down. Tolf is trying to pressure Airlock. Airlock is goes down, surrounded by uh, Flats Inc. Plick Lice is the only one left. Plick is really by himself. He's gonna jump back. Kichi's now in going towards zone. Tolf it throws a hammer, doesn't connect to anyone. Plick looks like it's gonna go behind everyone here. There's the Booyah Bomb. Tolf knows his Plick. Plick is gonna get pushed back. Plick, here. Yeah, pl yeah, Plick is getting pushed back, but it's two members on the other on the other side. It's basically kind of, it's so it's so split right now as to as to what we're what we're seeing here in terms of the in terms of the action. Ink Sword is coming in though. This should hopefully put well a bit of ink. In, uh, oh in no, two Apostle goes down. It's just Plick. Tolf can just yep. Tolf Plick just goes out. down to Tolf. Tolf oh. splash down cancels Plick. Quarter comes in. We got ten down. seconds left on the timer. Eight, eight down. Five oh, no, the hammer left, eight. and that's it. That's gonna that's be it. game. Splat we... moves to f moves on in the winners bracket. Yeah, Splat completes the reverse sweep. They will go on to winners brackets. Pasta drops to losers bracket, where they will where they will await one of the losers in the winners side.